my plan for Christmas is to be grateful. I, you know, uh, with the economic situation in the country, a lot of people um, don't have the things they would have loved to have to use in celebrating Christmas. But I don't think those are really the key things. I think the major thing is to be grateful to God. And whatever you have, you use it to celebrate Christmas so that you don't put pressure on yourself. So I'm going to be very happy. I'm going to uh, call my loved ones. I'll visit my loved ones. And whatever I have, I'll use it to celebrate my Christmas. That's how I'm going to celebrate my Christmas. 2023 Christmas is a spectacular one for me. I mean, the year has been full of lots of hurdles, ups and downs. But despite that, we have to mark the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. He came into the world that we may be set free. So first of all, this, his, this, that celebration is sure. So we're just going to keep everything in moderation. We all know the, the, the whole economic crunch and all of that. But despite that, we're going to have a lot of fun. Church masses for us Catholics and back at home, meeting together with family and celebrating with friends in our own moderate way and the way that we can, to the glory of God, it is also the glory of God. We can't just sit back and relax and say that things are hard, or with the little we have, we are going to be thankful to God for it, and we're going to have to celebrate. This Christmas, I'm traveling back to my hometown, Anambra State, to celebrate my Christmas with my family people, extended family, and enjoy it. I intend to spend my Christmas holiday at the safari where I'll see wild animals, wild animals, and I'll have so much fun. Well, um, why in very, very challenging times, like you've said. And uh, for Christians, we have never lost our hope, and we have never lost our belief that everything is possible. And that's why beyond the celebrations, Christians are also praying that God should bring a visitation in this country that will change the narratives for people living in this country and people that are from this country. That's who we are as Christians. The year started with so many uncertainties, but here we are. God has been faithful, and we are here to say to the Lord, thank you. We also want to extend our love to our family members, our loved ones. Well, this year is uh, Christmas, you know, Today is like our Christmas, as in we are going to put everything together to celebrate. What I intend doing, or we intend doing as a department today, is um, to make the children to have a feel of what Christmas 